Thank you, Jason. An event is coming up commemorating the life and legacy of a legendary West Virginian. General Chuck Yeager Aviation Day is an annual event dedicated to commemorating the life of the first person to break the sound barrier. It will also serve as a way of inspiring the youth to explore the world of aviation. I'm here with Samuel Dennis, who is the manager of the Jackson County Airport, and he is going to tell us more. Good morning and thank you for joining us. Morning. Um, so General Chuck Yeager, just um, it, it's I'm sorry. Oh no, you're completely fine. Okay. Um, uh, General Chuck Yeager Aviation Day, it is a day that we are excited to have at the Jackson County Airport mm -hmm. with the uh, working with Victoria has been wonderful over the last year. Mm -hmm. We have been, uh, we've been hard at it and we have so much going on for this event. Uh, we are going to have a uh, pancake breakfast. Mm -hmm. Uh, in the morning, uh, Parkersburg South Junior ROTC mm -hmm. is going to be joining us um, and presenting callers that morning. Um, we're going to have an old uh, World War uh, II steerman at the event mm -hmm. and uh, our health net location, um, we have health net base there at the airport. They're also going to open up the helicopter for the kids and everything to see. Oh, that's awesome. Um, we are there's going to be RC planes, flight simulators available. Uh, Darkside Robotics is bringing in their large robot uh, robot in. Oh, that's awesome. um, th possibly 3D printers okay. and just so much more for the kids. The kids will have a chance to fly RC planes, um, use simulators, and just have a good time in general for for the day. That's awesome. It sounds like a really cool way to introduce them into aviation and just STEM in general. Yes, it, and it is. And, and this is a big part of uh, Miss Yeager. She, you know, she wanted to do this. She wants to bring light uh, mm -hmm. of the STEM activities to the kids here in Jackson County. Um, they actually have a um, a group coming in to Ripley High School uh, to do some drone activities at the high school tomorrow. Uh, which is just fantastic. What she's doing is wonderful. That's awesome. And I know that this Aviation Day is named after General Chuck Yeager, yes. who is a West Virginian and just very well known throughout the world of aviation, yes. not just here in the state. So what, how, what does it mean to you to be able to host this event and have it kind of sort of be in his honor in part? For me personally, uh, as an Air Force vet, mm -hmm. um, being able to <clears throat> honor uh, Chuck Yeager and keep his memory alive and going here in West Virginia just means it means a lot to me and our community um, you know everybody's so excited for this event and especially in working with Victoria Yeager as yes well. yes it's amazing and so the last question that I really have is is there anything else that you would like to add or that you feel is important to say that people should know um, parking is going to be limited. We are doing everything we can to go and make sure we can move people back and forth for the event mm -hmm. um, to their cars and everything. But it's, it's going to be a good day. Be patient with us. This is our first major event at the Jackson County Airport in, in about 10 years. So we're really looking forward to it. And so that's really all I got. That's amazing. And that sounds like such a fun event for all of the kids that are going to be there, just learning about aviation, getting involved in it and STEM. And it just sounds like a wonderful thing for the community. Thank you so much for being here to talk with us about no this. No problem. Thank you. Thank you. And when we come back, Jason is going to have another check on your morning forecast. Stay tuned.